so crazy, I can't understand it. Living my dream, I'm feeling fantastic. Real to go, they feel like it's magic. So I grind on my way up to have it. Hop in my bag, you know I'ma fuck it up. Bitches want me cause they know I got it all. Used to run up the street trying to fuck it up. Had to go get my own, then I run. Out. Tell me how you do it. I got a drama mind. You can stop it. You can't copy. Hey! What up, family? It's your boy, Ro Promix. Man, y'all know what time it is. Keep it real and simple. Hey, man. Hmm. Yeah, wait. Ah! Yo, oh, man. Hey, man, I just already seen the time. Look, man, we back again with another Iranian musical, man. To my Persian people, my first speaker, Salam Korea. Look, man. We here with it. Another recommendation that was recommended to me. Uh, my brother Radioactive Zone recommended this to me. I saw it a lot in the comment section as well. And even on my Instagram, you know, people were sending it to me to, you know, check it out, react to it. I tagged this person, you know, on my Instagram like not too long ago. And uh, <clears throat> apparently this guy dropped this song and... The day that he dropped the song, he got arrested and got locked up. Which is the fucking dumbest shit that I've ever heard in my life. Like, because somebody is against what the government is doing and made a song. As like a song I think it's some type of like a Freedom Fighter song. And y'all lock him up for it tw within 24 hours of him posting the damn song. Like, bro, I don't get y'all, man. Like, where is your humanity, bro? Where's your humanity? Like, it's like, you guys want the people of Iran to, you know, follow Islam and do it the way the government wanted to. But I'm sorry, Islam does not tell you to treat people like this. Because this is not how, like, I'm, I'm raised Christian and Muslim. So I know how things is. I know how it is. Like, I know both sides. I know about the Quran. I know about the Bible. I've read both. I read, it. I read the Quran growing up as a kid. I go to mosque, I pray, I go with my family. So I'm raised both religion. So, but Iran, uh, Islam does not tell you to treat your people like this for, the, for them to follow Islam. No. Are you serious? Like, come on, man. Come on, man. This is dictatorship. This has nothing to do with the religion. This is dictatorship. But look, man, we're gonna get straight into the video. Before we do, I need you guys to go ahead and subscribe, like, and leave a comment down below if you're new to my channel, bro. Sha! Hey, man! And please don't forget to hit that post notification bell. Y'all see that guy over there, y'all? Y'all go ahead and smack the shit out of that nigga, man. So you guys understand my post, y'all already know. It's cause it's bangers. And we're gonna get straight into this shit. It's bangers all the way. Yeah, check. Let's do this shit. We got Shervin Haji. Haji Hag, I don't know how to pronounce the name, man. I do long as shit. Haji Hag Hapur. <laughs> Haji Hag Hapur. Barai. Barai Azadi. Barai Azadi. I don't know what that means, but he's got an English subtitle, so we're going to snap right into it. All right, so let's do it. Let's do it. برای توی کوچه رخ سیدم برای ترسیدم به وقت بوسیدم برای خواهرم خواهرت خواهرام برای تغییر مغز ها که پوسیدم برای شرمندگی برای بی پولی برای حسرت یک زندگی معمولی Bro, the crazy thing is like Iranian people Oh my gosh, bro Oh, bro this shit is sad, bro. Like, bro, I'm... Bro. Like, bro, a lot of Iranian people are so fucking gifted, bro. Talented. Like, from artists to the kids to... Like, bro, y'all see my thumbnails, bro. Like, I don't make that shit myself. My thumbnail is being made by Iranian guys, like my Iranian friends, you know what I'm saying? In Iran. My video get edited by Iranian people. 
subtitle. The subtitle, you see this shit writing right there. It was written by a, 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 a 14-year-old, bro. If not, it was 17, 14. I, I don't even remember. Like, shout out to that little boy, man. Like, it's the one that does my subtitle in Iran. Like, and it's like people have this talent just to feed themselves. And they get lucky and blessed to have people outside of Iran being able to work with them and pay them so they can feed themselves. Because the government is not, bro. I'm I'm done, bro. Let's let's increase this quality. It's crazy, bro. The child labor and the crushed dreams, like that's what I'm saying. Like a lot of people in Iran are so gifted, talented. They have the this dream that they want to achieve so much in life, but they can't because their dreams are being crushed. They're not allowed to be what they want to be. Like, some have to leave Iran and go to other country just to achieve their dreams. So people like 021G, 021Kid, like uh, Amir Tatalu. I don't know about every other artist that left Iran. They left Iran. Like, even female artists like uh, Sherry. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, seeing that shit happen is like, Women have to live, they have to leave Iran to go to other countries so they can achieve their, their dreams. Because if they was to do that in Iran, they might get killed. Like, what the fuck is your problem, y'all? That shit is crazy, man. Like this is the prime example. This guy got locked up as soon as he dropped this song. Within 24 hours, he got locked up. Like, if y'all get what I'm trying to tell you, like he literally got locked up just for being so gifted and talented to speak about what's going on in Iran. <laughs> For never experiencing this moment, Rira was killed on the Ukrainian flight along with 175 passengers. That's crazy. sense is like for this forced heaven is like you're trying to force this so-called heaven on us like please if that is heaven heaven is not going to be killing us like heaven don't kill people you die to go to heaven but heaven don't come down and kill you the people in earth are the one killing you and try to send you to heaven or claiming they're sending you to heaven let people live their life, man, please. He said for Afghan kids, because I know the same type of like situation happened like this in Afghanistan too, because I have a friend that's from Afghan, and... He, he said they have to leave the country because it's just fucking crazy. It's just as similar as what happens in Iran. So like, yeah, and I've been seeing some Afghan like people commenting, "Oh, can you react to our content? Can you check us out?" Blah blah. I probably will still check it out, but yeah, it's just like for now, it's just everything that's going on right now is just crazy. It's crazy, man. For all this meaningless uh, <clears throat> slogan, forced to chant "Death to America," etc. For the collapse of this flame. Oh wow. That's crazy. Oh poor man.
خواب و بی خوابی برای مرد میهن آیا خوشی پس از شبای طول برای ورس های هست For the sleeping pills in our sleepless nights Tabu bi khawi baraye mard mihan abadi baraye dokhtari ke arzu dasht be sab for the girls that wish were born boys mm. and i think in that sense is like for the girls that wish they were born boys because like not every woman are really physically strong to defend themselves you know when it comes down to it. even guys that can be physically strong to defend themselves you know and it's like they still get fucked up you know what i'm saying but i think also furthermore is like guys have like more privilege than the woman does which is just fucking insane it's so fucking stupid even in america it's like Guys have more privilege than the woman does. It's only one thing that woman has that's like it's a different type of power in America that's like a woman can literally run a man's life if they want to in America. You know what I'm saying? But the power that men have, men have the that they have so much power. You know what I'm saying? They just have to make sure that they don't cross a line that's going to make their power go down the drain, you know? And that's the same thing in, in I feel like in Iran like men have more you know more chances more grace than women does women have been treated like shit and that's stupid man that's just fucked up like shout out to every woman out there that is keeping strong that is keep fighting like you can't change who you are you can't change from being a woman to a man if that's possible a lot of women would have done it you know what i'm saying but like respect to y'all man all love and respect بود برای زن زندگی آزالی برای آزالی برای میهن آبادی برای دختری که آرزو داشت به سر بود برای زن زندگی آزالی برای آزالی برای آزالی برای آزالی Servant who was arrested after releasing this video. <sighs> hey man, shout out to uh. Shervin, I hope that's how you pronounce his name, Shervin, for making this song, for making this video. Respect to you where you at. Shout out to you. Like this song is actually very touching, and I really appreciate you, you know, for making this song. You know, for the people of Iran, for the women most especially, because like they need us. And that's the thing. Like women need us as men. There's always been this fight of oh, men are better than women. Women are better than men. This old, nah. At this point, fuck all that shit, bro. Like that shit that should not even matter. Like you know, as a man, you know where you stand. You know what you're capable of. Then keep that shit to yourself. Woman, you know what you are. You know what you're capable of. Keep that shit to yourself. What is mostly important right now is us coming together and saying fuck all that shit that we fight about and let's fight for each other, not against each other. Let's fight for each other. Let's stand up for each other. Men stand up for women, women stand up for men. Let's fight against what is actually fighting against us. Because just like 
in society, society says men should not cry. You know what I'm saying? Because if you cry, you you you're weak. You're considered weak. Like, and people have lived through that for a very long time, thinking, oh, if I cry as a man, I'm weak. No, like that is society. Like you are a human being. Like you are created to be able to do these things. You're not a robot. Nobody's a robot. And when saying women cannot do what they want to do for themselves, like, what, who are you to do that? Who are you to control that? Who are you to tell women cannot do what they want to do for themselves? We got men out here doing some reckless shit, and some men are telling some women that, oh, no, you can't do that. No, you cannot do that. Who are you? You're a man, she's a woman. You're a human being. It has nothing to do with your gender. You are a fucking human being. Fight for each other, not against each other. Fight against this motherfucker's so-called government that's, that's, you know, destroying the people. We're supposed to stand up against the government and be strong together because without us, they ain't shit. Without us, the people, the government is nothing. I'm just speaking the truth. It's just facts. The government is nothing without the people. They only kill people just to put fear in the rest of the people that is going to have to stand down. But we, if you fight together as one, we definitely going to win. I love y'all, man. Y'all stay blessed. Hey, stay strong. Let's keep fighting. We're in this together. We're in this together. I'm not backing down either. I'm going to be here, give y'all amazing content, try to make you guys smile through the pain, and... Also making sure I'm here to stand with you guys. I stand with you guys. I'm here with you guys. And we're going to do this shit together. My voice will be put out there. I'm not going to sit down and not say anything. I feel this. Because I don't want this to happen to any of my family either. And I don't want none of this to happen to no. I don't, I don't even wish this on nobody. Not even talking about my family. On nobody. I wish peace, love, respect, joy, and happiness in everybody's life, man. I love y'all. Y'all stay blessed. Uh, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're new. God love you. God bless y'all, man. Good efforts.